Hello, everybody. This is the Almost Daily Devotion uh, for Thursday, May the 14th. I hope you're doing well today. Um, writer and critic uh, Alan Jacobs, who's excellent, uh, wrote a short piece recently uh, about the seductions of predictions. The seductions of predictions. So timely. And, I mean, of course you've noticed uh, how everybody falls prey to the seduction of prediction during this uh, pandemic. It's like who, you know, doesn't want to appear wise uh, about what will uh, happen in the future. Well, um, obviously some people know more than other people, but nobody knows everything. <laughs> nobody knows everything. Um, Jacobs rightly says that some of these um, predictions, these prognosticating articles should never have been written. I, I wonder if how many of them are written and fueled by the twin sins of both control and pride. Um, so I love uh, Jacob's uh, concluding sentence uh, to his essay, where he, he says this, but in any case, if I were the world's greatest computer hacker, I'd inject some code into stories like this, that would insert every five sentences, William Goldman's justly famous and transcendently wise line, nobody knows anything. And uh, man, I love that. And uh, to wit, I will give you Proverbs uh, chapter 26, uh, verse 12, uh, where we read, do you see persons wise in their own eyes? There is more hope for fools than for them. There is more hope for fools than for them. Um, we like to bandy about the phrase, God only knows. And here you can cue the Beach Boys' great song. Go listen to that. Um, but God only knows. God only knows. That is a phrase, a, a, a declaration that we can truly stand behind. For we know that the only one who truly knows everything is the only one who has the mercy and the power to bring healing to our world. And I'm going to pray a prayer, excellent prayer, from the prayer book. Uh, and it's called A Prayer for Guidance. Let us pray. O oh God, who by whom the meek are guided in judgment and the light rises up in darkness for the godly. Grant us in all our doubts and uncertainties the grace to ask what you would have us to do. The spirit of wisdom, that the spirit of wisdom may save us from all false choices and that in your light we may see light and in your straight path we may not stumble through Jesus Christ our Lord. Amen. I hope you're doing well today. I'll see you tomorrow.